He is the gin foil chef, a man with a video love. Hey YouTube, how's it going? Well, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Not too bad a day. The temperatures outside did go up a little ways into the upper 40s, I think it was. And not too bad. Still on the cold side, and yeah. But I'm hoping to be able to do some work, do something about that hopefully soon. I got a good shot now, thanks to some wow surprise, of uh, being able to do something about that uh, when things happen next month. We'll see about that. It's looking good though. In any event, I don't want to talk about me. I want to talk about a poker legend. Now this guy is not what you call a regular bracelet winner. He's not a regular uh, attendee or a person who is going to be a regular contender for the final table at the main event or anything like that but he is kind of a legendary person because he did some legendary stuff you see Hal Lubarski when he was 29 had a problem with retinitis pigmentosa that cost him his eyesight blind totally you know like a bat uh, well that's probably a misnomer but you know what I mean no vision no seeing you would think normally that this would make it difficult to play poker. Not so. He had a talk with the casino management at the place where the uh, World Series of Poker in 2007 was going to be held, Harris Casino. And after some back and forth and whatnot, they agreed to allow him to have a helper. A person whose sole job would be to tell him what his hole cards were and what were the community cards on the table. And so with that help he entered into the 2007 World Series Poker and he played. And he played fairly good poker surprisingly enough for not being able to see anything. And imagine being able to playing poker without being able to see the players around you so you're not going to get any kind of a visual read off of them because no vision yeah uh-huh well he did pretty good the field that year was uh, over 6300 people playing in the tournament and Hal Lubarski finished in 197th place taking home $51,000 in prize money not too shabby. So yeah, that makes him, in my mind, a poker legend. And some friggin' movie. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I'm out of here.